This video will show you an example of the image capture service over Ethernet IP using a micro, MicroLogix explicit message. We are already starting up with the basic message already been set up, so uh, I'll double click on the setup screen here so you can take a look at it. Now the custom service code is 4B for image capture service, so I'm going to go ahead and put a 4B in for the service code. Now this message does not require any receive information, so you can put a zero for the receive information. And we're going to send one byte of information from L11. Uh, that's going to be the trigger number. So I'll show you that in a minute here when I do the message. But bit 0 will be trigger 1, bit 1 will be trigger 2, bit 2 is trigger 3, and bit 3 is trigger 4. So you'll see that in a minute. But you just to specify which trigger that you want to fire, and it will trigger the system. Again, the message is already set up here. We have a CVX that's already been set up with Ethernet IP enabled and a program running on this address here. So we'll go ahead and close that and we'll upload this or download this to the PLC actually. So we'll go ahead and download this to the PLC. We'll put the PLC in run mode. And then we'll uh, show you how this message. So again, just to show you the message command, it's 4B and we're sending one information, one byte of information from L11. If I open up L11, show you what this looks like here. Just change this to binary so you can actually see it. You can see we already have this bit here, toggle to one, but basically this bit zero is gonna be trigger one, this is gonna be trigger two, trigger three, and then trigger four, depending on how much triggers you have on this system. We're gonna go ahead and just specify trigger one, so we're gonna turn on bit zero, as you can see, it already is. So if we're ready, we can go ahead and issue, issue our message. And I'll go ahead and uh, just manually toggle this bit. And uh, if the message is successful, you can see you get a done bit here for the message. So again, if we want to trigger again, I'll just toggle it off and back on, and the system will be triggered. So that's it. That's it for the image capture custom service using Ethernet IP explicit messaging on the MicroLogix PLC.